week I am testing the brand new Ford Escape. It's a five-seater SUV. Let's find out how good it is as a baby drive. And don't forget to like and subscribe and follow us on our socials. <laughs> the child seat section of this review is brought to you by InfraSecure. In the back of the Ford Escape, there are Isofix in the two outer rear seats and top tether anchorages on the back of all three that are easily accessible through the boot. Now I could just fit three InfraSecure child seats in the back here. I've got two Attain More and one Achieve More. Now you would have to be very careful which child seats you install in the back here if you do want to get three across. Now legroom is pretty good in the back of the Escape too. We found with rear facing child seats we could just fit a 180 centimetre driver in front or a 184 centimetre passenger. To learn more about the child seats used in this video just click on the link here. In the back there are mat pockets on the back of both front seats that will hold and conceal an iPad and a little shelf in the back of the central console box that's good for a phone. The door bins are smaller back here and will just hold a 600ml water bottle. Storage in the front is good. There are two cup holders in the central console. They'll hold a reusable and a disposable coffee cup. Behind them is a little well that's good for a phone and in front of them is a wireless phone charging well. And there's USB-C and 12 volt sockets in there too. There's also a net on the side of the central console good for the passenger's phone. The glove box is a good size in here that will hold my iPad and wallet with the manual and there's a glasses case in the ceiling and the door bins are a good size, they'll hold a large refillable water bottle and a wallet will fit in there too. There are aircon vents in the back of the central console in the Ford Escape which is fantastic for keeping those rear passengers the right temperature. The boot of the Escape opens electronically and nice and quietly. Let's find out how much we can fit in the boot. Empty, it will hold 12 shopping bags, or a twin pram and two shopping bags, or a tandem pram and five shopping bags, a single pram and six shopping bags, or a compact stroller and 10 shopping bags. The Escape is a really nice car to drive. I find visibility is really good in here, especially out of the back, even when you've got three child seats installed. It's really nice and easy to park and manoeuvre and it's pretty light to steer to. The media system in the Ford Escape has Apple CarPlay and Android Auto which is fantastic. Now the system itself is quite basic and there are lots of settings that you can adjust. I like the fact you can turn a lot of the driver assist things on and off in this screen here. Now when you pop it into reverse that camera image, it is quite a small screen, so it's a small image to look at and it is a tiny bit milky, but you can turn those parking sensors on and off easily down in the central console. So to sum up with the Escape, it does fit a twin pram nicely in the boot and you can just get those three child seats across the back seats. The media system and cameras are good and the drive is nice too.